I'm going to create Regions United, a team that will consist from only Regions. Every time a player retires in FC25, the game will automatically generate an under 21 player from the same country, having the same positions and similar stats to the original player, aka Region. We will be signing maximum 4 Regions per season until we win the Champions League. We are starting our journey in 2025-2026 season in the Serie B and we already scouted some regions. The first player that we have found is Kevin Lefebvre, a Belgian and attacking midfielder but he is not the region of Kevin De Bruyne but Chris Mertens. And luckily for us we got him from the free agency. After spending a lot of time on a hunt for good regions, I did found this guy. Maxwell John, Ghanaian right winger, right mid or a striker from Lyon. He is currently 73 we rated and we managed to sign John from Lyon for seven and a half million euros. But not every region player we are allowed to sign in this video. Maximum two players from free agency per season. All regions should represent different nations in the team and we are also limited to the budget we have for every season. Definitely it is not going to be easy to sign the regions of best of the best. If you want high quality football kits Soccerators.co is the choice. They have broad variety of different jerseys, good reviews around the world and most importantly the quality is top. I just got my first kit from Socurators.co and it is beautiful, elegant and delivered just in time. Don't forget to use my coupon code OBN for a discount at the checkout. Thanks Socurators.co for sponsoring this video. We also managed to find Nacho Gomez, a Mexican youngster center midfielder from Anderlecht. He is only 16 years old and already is 71 rated. Nacho Gomez is coming in only with long ball pass. Of course he is going to be a starter right next to John and Lefebvre. He will be the last signing for us in the first season as after those transfers we have only 543 thousands in the budget. We reached the end of the season in the Serie B KT where we finished only in the 20th place dead last in the league with 19 points to our name. In terms of stats John played 37 games and scored only 5 providing 3 assists. Lefebvre with 3 goals and 7 assists. Definitely the this is one of the worst seasons I could have imagined. Hopefully next season there will be a lot more regions to choose from. Right in the beginning of the second season we managed to find this guy Thomas Moretti in a free agency. 19 years old Italian center back and he will be the first defender we added to our regions team. He's currently 74 rated with 6 playstyles, great addition to the team. Next player that we have managed to find is Harley Coles, 76 rated center defender midfielder only 20 years old the region of Jordan Henderson currently Coles is the highest rated player in our starting 11. To fit to our system Harley Coles need to be converted to a center midfielder and it will take 26 weeks for him pretty much the half of a season. We still have 7 million euros budget for this season so let's sign one more player. If only we had enough funds. Look at this gem, Dakir Al Muvalat, 83 rated center back at the age of 20, representing Saudi. This would have been too perfect, I guess. And well, we have found a pre of Lionel Messi, Jorge Soto, right winger, striker, and camp, but I am pretty sure that Messi is still playing. The game has already generated his pre -gen. The last player that we are going to sign in this transfer window is going to be Patrick Peters. 18 years old goalkeeper from PSV. He is most definitely the region of Jasper Silesen. Anyways, we did improve goalkeeping position massively. In two seasons, we managed to add 6 regions to our starting 11. But other players are currently way lower rated, so I don't think we stand a chance to fight for a promotion this season. And this time we are 17th in the league with 33 points. A little bit of improvement compared to the previous season. But as expected, in the Coppa Italia we have been beaten in a first round itself. And in terms of stats it was Maxwell John who lead the line with 11 goals and 3 assists. 5-5 five and five from Kevin Lefebvre and that's it. But in terms of growth we got good results and pretty much every player that we have signed is growing steadily. The next season we need to sign strikers and if we manage to find any good regions probably we have chances to be promoted to the Serie A. In the beginning of the third season we managed to find this guy Hamidou Kamara center back 
center mid or center defensive midfielder from Togo, 75 rated already from free agency. And he will be our first signing of the season. And yes, another free agent, but we had to choose this route, cause we are still in the Serie B and our budget is only 7 millions for this season. To somehow strengthen our team, we need to find another great free agent. And we did exactly that. Jean Edo Koulibaly from Ivory Coast is another center back free agent that we are going to sign this season. He joins us as a 76 rated player, but we are yet to sign a striker for our team. Cause current setup up front is really poor. And I guess we can go with this guy, Madani Abdullah, 71 rated striker from Iran. He is the region of Mehdi Taremi. And for only 4 millions, we signed Abdullah from Fiorentina. He is currently 71 rated with no playstyles on him. And he is the ninth player that we have added to our first 11. Except for Fiore and Ricci. All other players are regions that we have signed during these three seasons. I hope that is enough to guarantee us long awaited promotion to the Serie A. Well, we did not get promotion this season as well, only 11th in the league and in the Coppa Italia we made the round of 16, but Inter beat us, I wanted to say Lombardia FC. And in terms of goal contributions, Madani Abdullah had 15 goals and 2 assists and 10 goals and 6 assists for Maxwell John. The team itself does look very good, we need to update the left mid and striker position next season. But for that we need to get very lucky with free agents, cause I I believe we are going to have a very small budget for one more season. And we did get lucky. Leon Cohen, French striker, 78 rated, 19 years old only. He will be the next free agent that we are going to sign. And just like that, Leon Cohen is joining our team and taking the striker spot right away. I believe Cohen is a region of Karim Benzema. And as expected, we got only 8 million euros to spend this season. And because of that, we are going to sign one more free agent. And luckily for us, we we managed to find a super one, Abdel Wahab Amin, right winger representing Egypt, already 78 rated with 32 million euros market value. And of course he is the region of Mohamed Salah. Abdel Wahab Amin is an exciting prospect, I'm going to convert him to a right midfielder. We can convert John to play from a left side and just like that our first 11 is assembled. But yet we need to add a lot of players to our bench, the best player that we can sign in our budget is Leonardo Gonçalves, Brazilian left midfielder from Ferenc Varos. But sadly he is not for sale, we have to find another talent. But before that, if you are enjoying the video, go and smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. Maybe we can sign this guy, Ionel Marin, 72 rated left midfielder from Romania. And for just 5 million we sign Marin from Nice. He does have good potential on him and can be a great backup for Maxwell John. As we are pretty much out of our budget, let's simulate and pray for promotion. And yes guys, we are finally promoted to the Serie A from the second place. But in the Coppa Italia, we were eliminated from the first round itself. And in terms of stats, it was Leon Cohen, outscored Abdullah 19-3. and But to be fair, 17-4 and from Madani Abdullah is also great. Good stats from Nacho Gomez as well. I believe this team is pretty much ready to compete in the Serie A as well. And guys, I am in absolute disbelief. Our transfer budget is only 17 millions in the Serie A. How we are supposed to sign anybody good with this money? So once again we are going to heavily rely on free agency. And first amazing region we managed to find in Austria. Walter Koch is 78 rated, 16 years old only, 6.7 height and he is the region of David Alaba. So let's sign him immediately. He is going to be the central center back in our team with anticipate bruiser and long throw playstyles. And that was just the beginning. In free agency we managed to find Polish striker David Kowalczyk, 37.5 million euros market value. He is definitely Robert Lewandowski's region. Of course we signed him and he will be replacing Abdullah in the starting 11 with bruiser, flair and aerial playstyles. After updating contracts for all our players, we got only 8 million left in the transfer budget. 
So let's try to find someone for our bench. And with remaining 8 millions in our budget, we can sign Jordan Zola, center midfielder from Central African Republic. He is most probably the region of Geoffrey Kondogbia. So let's simulate this season and see whether we can end it in the European spot. Our first season in the Serie A and we are 8th right away. I think this is a pretty decent result for our team. And it was Milan who won the league. Coppa Italia goes to Juventus. This time again we were out from the first round itself. This is embarrassing. The best goal scorer of our team was Leon Cohen as expected. 22 goals and 5 assists on his name. Maxwell John from the left midfielder position 17 and 9. Kovalchik did a decent job as well, although he played only 29 games. I guess they shared the time with Madani Abdullah. But in the starting 11, we need improvements. Koulibaly and Lefebvre, they're actually stagnated in their development. Hopefully next season we will have enough money to replace them. This is a joke. How can we improve this team with only 26 millions? The only way to sign a world-class player with that amount of money is of course a free agency. Fortunately for us, we have found Mark Kirali, Hungarian centre-back in free agency. We immediately signed him for our team and is going to replace Koulibaly in the starting 11. We also managed to find Gabriel Borges in free agency. Senna defensive midfielder from Brazil, 79 rated at 19 years old. I guess he is the region of Casemiro and I decided to not touch the last bit of cash. Hopefully next season we will have enough money to sign one world-class Senna attacking midfielder. We reached the end of the season and it seems that Kovalchik, Robert Lewandowski's region, is getting the player of the season award. Sadly we are only third in the league. 71 points for Milan to win the Serie A, but very respective season from Regions United. And in the Coppa Italia as well, we lost to Milan. And in terms of stats, oh my god, Leon Cohen with 35 and 13. How did David Kovalchik won the Serie A player of the season with 27 and 14 in the league? When Cohen scored 31 and got 12 assists as well. What a brilliant season from our two strikers, as well as Lefebvre. I mean, fantastic numbers up front. We had to win this year, Serie A, man. Anyways, we got a lot of growth in our strikers and midfielders. Finally, we got decent money in the budget. 78 millions to spend. Maybe we are going to spend all our money to sign one player. It is Johannes Schroeder from Arsenal. 86 rated German center back. Let's see if we can pull this out. And after a little bit of negotiations, we managed to sign Schroeder for 69 million euros. Schroeder is coming in instead of Moretzi. He is most probably the region of Mats Hummels. And that's it. Hopefully this team is good enough to compete in the Champions Sleek. Sadly, one more time, AC Milan beats us in the race for the Serie A title. We lost another trophy, this time to Napoli, Supercoppa d'Italia. And would you believe this, AC Milan beats us in the Coppa Italia final as well. But instead, in the Champions League we were 7th in the league phase. In the round of 16, we beat Barcelona 5-5 aggregate score and we won on penalties. In the quarterfinals we eliminated Napoli 5-3 on aggregate. And we were better than Real Madrid in the semi finals. So we are going to face Olympic Leo in the Champions League final. In terms of stats, this time Kovalcic was absolute leader in the team. 41 goals and 12 assists. What an unbelievable season from Lewandowski's region. 19 and 4 from Cohen and great stats from Gomez. 21 assists and 16 goals from center midfielder spot. We do have Borges and Lefebvre on 82 rating. Other than that, we have pretty balanced squad and couple of great substitutions as well. We are good enough to beat Lyon and we need to prove it on the pitch. First chance we created in the 8th minute, but the ball hit the post after Lefebvre's attempt. 10 minutes later, David Kovalcic missed his chance to open the score for us. However, we managed to do so from the corner kick. Our center back go with a stunning header. We did continue to attack and attack, and at the back we were perfect. Not a single chance for Leo and 1-0 win in the Champions League final. Well, we won the ultimate trophy with regions only. Click here to watch me create the all-time World Cup 11 with Youth Academy only.